Hey guys, what's up? Uh, so today we are back with the 100 baby challenge. Uh, so right now we are with Kiera and she is actually hanging out. I keep wanting to call it the Shrieking Shack. <laughs> it's a little bar in Windenburg. It's actually right up the road from her house. That's our little house right over there. Um, so what we are doing right now is we are baby daddy hunting for baby number one. Um, I, I actually don't see any guys around here, but we're going to let time progress. She is actually going to come over here and maybe do some foraging because, as we know, we need to make money. Because if she's going to have 100 babies, that's just going to be... She needs some help here. <laughs> uh, I love, absolutely love, everything that they did when they created Windenburg. Um, it's... I just don't even... Um, the detail that they put into it was just spectacular. Like, most of the time in previous games you could be counted on to be able to find things very quickly, whereas like these little wild onion plants and wild bluebell plants and everything, they're very uh, scattered and you might not even be able to find them all and they spawn in different areas every time. Um, whereas like in The Sims 3 if you were gem hunting or something, that's gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Uh, if you're gem hunting or something, is this a man? This is a man. Are you a teenager? You are a teenager. Okay, Malcolm. We'll save you for later. Oh my god, that sounded creepy. Uh, okay, so, uh, but yes, like, it, you, you could find, uh, things by them being shiny or whatever happened, um, but I just, I don't know, I just love their, their detail and the fact that, I have no, oh, I think this goes up to the Von Windenberg estate or something. Um, I don't know, I just, I think it's fabulous and I think the way that they've really just put their heart into this game, um, is, it's beautiful and it, it's exciting and it makes me want to play. Um, whereas we've all probably had those moments where we decide... Hey, I'm a little bored. <laughs> um, you know. Oh, a time capsule. That's what she got. Okay. Um, we're gonna we're gonna head back to her, see where she's at. Maybe do some fishing. I don't know. She's gotta make some money while I scout out for guys. I'm not having very much luck. Oh, who are you? Are you an old man? And you're peeing in a bush. Thanks. Okay, Dennis Kim. Peace out. Um, <laughs> well, that's, that's, you know, one way to pick up a husband, or, sorry, not a husband, a boyfriend. She's not going to be getting married. Um, you know, hey, I noticed you were peeing in that bush over there, but, uh, was wondering if you would, uh, you know, help me have some babies. Oh my goodness, Mortimer Goth. Okay, we will be going after him later. He takes a lot of convincing if we are going to separate him from Bella, he is absolutely head over heels in love with her. So, uh, we'll leave him be for now. He's not a suitable guy. I'm thinking we might have to travel elsewhere just because, you know, as, as uh, you see how many ladies there are and I can't have babies with ladies. So, um, let's see here. We are, yeah, we're probably going to travel. Let's see. I don't know, maybe one of the more towards the city area. I chose this because it was pretty close to her house. Um, and, you know, apparently that's just not working for me. You can't be lazy when going after baby daddies. It doesn't work like that. Okay. Alright. No, we don't want to go to the ruins. Where is this a books library? A library or a nightclub? I don't know if it's the time for nightclubs. Um, the cafe. Let's go to the cafe and see what they got. Okay, hopefully we'll find a guy here. Any guy, really. <laughs> She's not picky. Okay. Oh my goodness. I also do want to work on fulfilling her wishes, just because the sooner that we get her, um, the fertility treatment, the more babies we can have. So, 
I will be, you know, okay, so she wants to buy a pool. Well, we can do that, sure. Um, oh no, your back hurts, that sucks. Hi Vivian, how are you? Go ahead, make friends while I scout out for guys. Oh, here's a whole bunch of ladies. The Caliente. Okay. Well, uh, more ladies. I, th I think all the dudes might be at work or something. I don't know. Or maybe they'll all populate here later. We'll have to wait and see. This is so beautiful. Oh my goodness. I haven't played too much in Windenburg, but I just... I love it. It's got that very old-timey English feel, and it's just... Gorgeous, and I don't know, like the, the fact that they were like, "Oh, we're gonna make like an actual canal over here." I don't know, it's killing me. Who are you? I think we're just having luck with ladies. Who are you? Ah, Bjorn. He's actually married, if I remember. But hey, married men aren't off limits. But we will see. If there's anyone else, if not, we're gonna go after Bajorn. I know I'm a bad, bad person. Okay, let's see here. Stop going through houses. I don't even know if they can get back here. Okay, oh, oh, hey, handsome. Yes, Marcus Flex. Okay, I think we're gonna go after Marcus because he is just fabulous. Obviously, he's part of the party house. And, oh, would you look at those eyes? Oh my goodness. But he's just adorable. Um, I've made clubs with him when Get Together just came out. And, uh, he's, he's pretty, he's pretty awesome. So we are going to introduce ourselves to Marcus. Friendly introduction. Alright, let's, let's do this. Get up. Hurry. He's waiting for you. <laughs> I don't know. I think he'll think she's very pretty. Because I think she's very pretty. Yes, of course, bring your latte with you. A little bouncy walk. Okay. She looks so fancy with her little cup of cup of cafe. Oh goodness. Hey, what's up? Put the walls up. He's non committal, apparently, or he talks about it. Uh, we are going to get to know him. <laughs> Discuss interests. Go for it. Let's uh, ask about his career. Let's have a deep conversation. She's playful from the coffee. Oh, the macchiato. Sorry. I'm not a coffee drinker. I'm a tea drinker or, you know, water or soda. Uh, we're not going to flash him crazy eyes. That's no. If we're mm -mm. we're going to ask him about his day. Just stick to the tame stuff. Guys run if they see the crazy eyes. So. Let's see. Um, share some ideas because she is creative. Alright. Let's see. Let's have a deep conversation. I want them to be a little bit friendly at first because if you're not friendly enough, he'll probably be like, whoa, whoa, I'm not into this. <laughs> oh, let's see here. Let's tell him a dramatic story. Because you're the fun type. Uh, engaging story sounds good too. We are not going to do either one of those things. They tend to just annoy people. So we don't want to do that. We can gossip. Gossip is fine. Let's, no, we're not going to tell him to go away. Tell him to joke about ducks. Ask about his day. Hmm. Is there an impression? Everyone loves to walk through our conversation. I think we might just be standing very horribly. As if there isn't this whole other part of the walkway that they could use. Nope. What else? Let's uh, have another deep conversation. Alright. And there you go. Yes, you too. 
Oh, she has the comedy skill. Okay, I've never heard of someone with comedy skill before, but she seems like she would be the type. Uh, let's ask to hang out. Wanna hang out, dude? Yes, step closer. Step much closer. He's like, yeah, sure, why not? Okay, so if we're hanging out then... Okay, you can hang out for a bit. Let's express admiration. Hmm. I always like asking the cloud gaze. It's just a little bit... Uh, it's fun for me. Oh, oh, yeah, that was fun. That was great. They just look so cute when they do it. People are just walking around them, you know. Because that's normal. Just lay down right there and just cloud gaze, because why not? Yep. Don't worry if you get stepped on. It'll be fine. <laughs> they look really cute together, actually. I think they would have amazing babies. Okay. Mm -hmm. She's so cute. Can't stand it. Actually, we're just going to do a mini photo op. Oh, missed the photo op. Alright. Yeah, my picture. Leave my picture alone. Alright, so we- oh, do you- have I been neglecting your needs? I have been. I'm sorry. Okay. Well. Is there a restroom in here? There is. Go to the restroom. Who are you trying to talk to? Don't order food from Dawn. Let's go. You're not that hungry yet? And then, yes, you can order some food. Oh, wrong bathroom, I guess. This one? There we go. Okay. And then you're gonna order her here. Let's have a cannoli, because why not? Oh man, it's getting busy. Look at all these other dudes. We are gonna do some introductions to these dudes here, just cause we're gonna need them later. And then you can friendly introduction, friendly introduction, friendly introduction. We are going to. Oh, she's probably really like making her own food. I'm confused. Did you get food? You didn't get food. What are you doing, honey? You, oh, you have cannolis. Okay, eat your cannolis. You can look at that girl. Well, Mortimer, what are we doing here? Stop staring at her like that, you weirdo. What? Don't grumble at her. Oh, you're talking. Whoa, I thought this was a chick. I'm sorry, dude. Mr. Clifton. Alright, well, we are going to... Well, have we already been introduced? I guess so. Hey dude, let's chit chat. Let's uh, let's just grab new ideas and maybe hug you. No, I don't want her to be a part of it. April Ferris, please. Whoa, hey Johnny Zest. Alright, we're having a group conversation I guess. I don't know. I hate when they do that though. Uh, bye everybody. Later, Clifton. And Johnny's ass. Peace out. Okay, maybe we can get him to come back to our place. They're pretty good friends now. I think that we should be able to, you know. Actually, we're gonna cut it here. Um, Alright, I'm running out of time. And I set a timer and it went off wrong. So, thank you guys so much for watching. We will come back next time um, and see if we can get these two lovely people to have a baby. Because I really think that Marcus and her would make gorgeous, gorgeous babies. So, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up for me. And if you think I'm awesome and you want to continue seeing what we have in store for Kiera and her 100 babies, uh, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. I put out new... 100 baby challenge videos every Sunday and Wednesday and uh, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching and Alright, see you guys next time